Local freight hotspot railway station, Stafford Railway Station, was first opened in July 1837 by the Grand Junction Railway. However, that station was demolished because it became inadequate and was replaced by a second station in 1844. That became inadequate too and was then built with a third station in 1862. Uh, but then that was then replaced by what is the current station in 1962, built as part of the modernisation programme of the West Coast Main Line. It also features a concrete brutalist building. Originally there were lines all over the country here, but most of these lines were closed in 1964 thanks to the Beaching Axe. Following the rebuilding of the station between 1961 and 1962 by the architect William Robert Headley, a narrow gauge engine built was built by local firm W.G. Bagnall to stand on a plinth opposite uh, Station Road at the junction of Railway Street. This was removed in the mid-1980s and now sits at the Amerton Railway. Most of these services today go a variety of different ways. Trains northbound can either go over the Norton Bridge flyover, onwards to Stoke and Trent and then Manchester Piccadilly, or they can go under the flyover to go to Crewe, and then onwards to the North Wales coast, Scotland, and via Manchester Piccadilly to Wilmslow, or they can go south and head to London Euston via the Trent Valley line through Nuneaton and Rugby, also down to Birmingham New Street, and then onwards to London Euston via Coventry. Today's shoot is a day-night shoot, starting at 1747 and finishing at 1844 on the 17th of October 2020. So, let's get things started with a flying Scouseman, as 390 148 departs with the 1744 of anti-west coast service from Liverpool Lime Street to London Euston. Next out is 35125, working the 1747 London Northwestern Railway service from Crewe to Birmingham New Street via Wolverhampton. Next to a passer of anti-west coast is 390-112, gliding through Stafford working 9 Charlie 85 from London Euston to Lancaster.
and quickly following on its tails is 39152 working 1H71 from London Euston to Manchester Piccadilly via Crew and Stockport. And as that comes to a stop at a red light, 352.39 and 352.41. Depart with the 1755 London Northwestern Railway service from Crewe to London Euston. Next to arrive at Stafford Station, 350.371. Working the 1757 London Northwestern Railway service from Birmingham New Street to Crewe via Stoke-on-Trent. to arrive for Avanti West Coast is 221-111 and 221-107, working the 1800 service from London Euston to Hollyhead and Wrexham General. Running about 32 minutes late, 390 008, worth 1858 from Manchester Piccadilly to London Euston. Closely behind that, running 58 minutes late, 390 155, worth 193 from Warrington Bank Key to London Euston. Next to arrive for Avanti West Coast is 390-129, working the 1827 service from London Euston to Liverpool Lime Street. Next to arrive at for cross country is 221131 and 220029, working the 1828 service from Oxford to Manchester Piccadilly via Stoke on Trent.
using Platform 1 as a rarity. 350, 375 and 350, 121. Work the 1810 London Northwestern Railway service from Liverpool Lime Street to Birmingham New Street. And as the night finally settles in, 221-119. Depart with the 1828 cross-country service from Manchester Piccadilly to Oxford via Birmingham New Street and Leamington Spa. Gliding through on the fast line, 390-123, working 1 Sierra 90 from London Euston to Glasgow Central. And having to use platform 1 to glide through, 390-002 works one Tango 15 from Wigan Northwestern to London Euston, running 18 minutes late. Next to arrive at Stafford Station, 350-266 and 350-246. Working the 1836 London Northwestern Railway service from London Euston to Crewe. As the darkness sets in, 350-102 and 350-117 arrive with the slightly delayed 1838 London North Western Railway service from Birmingham New Street to Liverpool Lime Street. And this is going to be what is our final clip of the shoot as 390-134 and 350-249 depart with the eight slightly delayed 1841 Avanti West Coast service from Liverpool Lime Street to London Euston and the 1847 London Northwestern Railway service from Crewe to Birmingham New Street via Wolverhampton respectively.
Thank you so much for watching everyone. If you enjoyed what you saw, click on the two videos here at the end screen. It helps out the channel. Also don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you uh, are new and got this far. And we'll see you all in the next video folks, wherever that may take us. We'll see you then folks.